All right, man, here's something a little different, but uh, you know, still kind of cool and old. Got a 1972 um, Mercedes, it's a 220D, if I'm not mistaken. Um, yeah, man, I, these are pretty cool little cars, man. Um, you know, I think I'm gonna, when I come across one of these, I'm gonna try to pick one of these up, man. Not the four-door model, but the the two-door, because there's actually a two-door model of these. Looks pretty cool, but um, yeah. Let's take a quick look at it, you know, the interior here. I guess it was a you know, manual, but can't really get get it to get the uh, shifter to move any way other way except up and down <laughs> or front, and forward, and reverse. Um, but uh, back and forth, actually. It's an aftermarket radio. Looked it up. I uh, wish it would have been the original. An original one. Man, those things are worth some money. Um, pretty neat. Here it says start to pull or is it stop push engine. Uh oh. <laughs> oh crap. Got the uh, parking brake. The release is right here. Pretty neat. But yeah, I don't know what this is for. Lights, wipers. I like the knob here. Opens the quarter window here. Yeah, it's pretty neat. But the interior is pretty nice. I mean, you know, still in decent shape. Headliners not ripped or anything. Too bad the steering wheel's got cracks in it. Um, door panels are all right. I tell you, man, it's, I'm six foot four and I have plenty of room in here, man. You no know, headroom too. Yeah, I'd like to get me one of these. The video gauges. You know, I don't know what the quality is nowadays on video, but back then it used to be pretty good dash it's got a couple cracks in it but uh yeah let's go outside and take a look at it she's not in the best of shape but yeah 220 diesel i think it was a four cylinder on these in here doors open really nice though I'll tell you man the seats are held up pretty good you know and the door panels Even back then, man, quality, man. <laughs> tell you, well, except for the uh, <laughs> the trim around the, uh, the ring there and the gauges. <laughs> Take a look at the front there. So I'm not I'm not really a fan of the uh, of the four door, the saloon, you know, as they're called. But um, the the two door version, yeah, pretty good looking cars. And there it is. I think the 220. Yeah, that stand for the, uh, the size of the engine, I think. 2.2 liter, I think, maybe. I think that's what it was. Interesting. Uh, battery there. But it looks to be all there. Got a York compressor. if I can find me a two-door version I've ran across a couple of them and I, I didn't pull the trigger on them but uh, I think next time I am 
It's a, like I said, the four door is not the best looking car, but the two door version is really cool looking, I think. So, one more look at it. These models were from like 68, I think, when they started to 76, from what I read. So, you know. out of here it's getting late so all right man to the next one then